the world is old and the powers grown weary, then Morgoth, the black foe of the world, shall break the door of night and return out of the timeless void. Therefore shall the earth mourn, and the skies above be black. For the sun he shall turn to darkness, and the moon shall no longer shed her light. Valinor shall descend upon him as a searing flame, white and terrible. And in that day Tulkas, the mightiest of the Valar, shall strive with Morgoth, and on his right hand shall be Eonwe, and on his left Turin, son of Hurin, returning from the doom of men at the ending of the world. Then shall the last battle be gathered on the fields of Valinor.
Thereafter shall earth be broken and remade, and the Silmarils recovered out of the sea. Yeah. And the air. For Feanor will surrender them, and with their fire Yavanna shall rekindle the two trees, and a great light shall come forth. And the mountains of Valinor shall be leveled, so that the light shall go out over all the world. And in that light the Valar will grow young again, and the elves awake, and all their dead arise. the sons of men, they shall join anew. Music of the Idols.